Well guys, welcome back to the channel. As always, before we get started, please hit that subscribe button, give this video a big thumbs up, and hit that notifications bell. Today, I'm going to review a movie for you called Butchers, which was written and directed by Adrian Langley. I've been sent this movie to give it a watch and give it a review, because later on today, I'm going to be interviewing somebody that's in this movie called Simon Phillips. He's the one who kindly sent me it to watch. Uh, it's available in the US uh, on iTunes and digital and on demand but, uh, from the 12th of January. But, but for us in the UK, it's not available until the 22nd of January. So unfortunately, you're going to have to wait till then. But I can promise you it's going to be worth the wait. This film is called Butchers, which is written and directed by Adrian Langley. Basically, it's a, as, as a group of youngsters that break down in the middle of buttfuck nowhere. And they go for a wander, two of them go for a wander to, to look for a garage to see if they can get the car towed or fixed. And they stumble upon one of these brothers called Owen Watson, who is played by Simon Phillips. And somewhere along the line, down in the woods or down the road, is his brother Oswald Watson, who is played by Michael Swatton. Now, let's just say these two brothers are proper fucked up. They, they do live in, in Hillbillyville. It, it, it is in the middle of fucking nowhere. Like I said, if your car ever breaks down somewhere like that, don't go looking for a garage. Get out of your car and run the fucking way you came because you're not going to want to go that way because there's no going back. But like I said, this film, a lot of people are going to watch it and automatically gonna, they're going to think of movies like Wrong Turn and they're going to think of maybe the Texas Chainsaw Massacre and those sort of movies. But it's not. This is kind of its own own sort of movie. And, and I can promise all you horror fans out there and all you gore fans out there, you are really not going to wait long to see something happen in this movie before someone gets fucked up or chopped up or murdered. And for me, I absolutely loved it. It's my sort of movie all day long. I can watch these kind of movies every single day. Like I said, they're, they're these two brothers, the Watson brothers. They live, they live very isolated. But there's more going on in this movie than you realise. There's, there's lots of chase scenes. There's lots of action, and there, there is something else going on behind the scenes. And it, it's, it's an all-round great movie. It's really, it really is. It's a sick fucking movie. Like when you wrote this and, and you thought about this movie. What the fuck, man? Some of the scenes were just disgusting. And and you guys, all, all of you actors in it, absolutely fantastic. Like I said, the two brothers played by Simon and Michael, the two brothers Owen and Oswald, you really are twisted. and But very intelligent as well. Like, Owen is very, very clever and, and, and kind of well-spoken from where he's from. And... and it kind of makes it that more sick because if you would meet this person in a station or in a petrol station or wherever, you would just think he's a normal guy, but he's really, really not. And like I said, what they've got locked up back at their house is even more fucking twisted. There is like, I don't want to say too much about it because I do want you guys to watch it without knowing what's going on. I don't like to give spoilers away, but there is someone else that lives in this house with the brothers <laughs> um, and yeah I, I really like for me the ending they've left it open for a for a second movie for me and and i'm praying that there is a second movie coming out of this film because i don't think it will disappoint it's it's a it's a really really good watch i want you guys to check out this trailer and have a little look
bye bye. You go die. talk a bit that's trail a bit done like i said i'm very lucky to have watched this film a little bit earlier than the rest of you guys in the uk but later on today i am interviewing simon phillips who plays owen in the movie i'm now going to rate this movie i rate them between one shit five absolutely fucking fantastic i'm going to give this a four i really really enjoyed it the kill scenes were good fun the acting was good the, the characters were great. The, the two twisted brothers are great. The, there's a couple of other characters thrown in there that I've not even mentioned because I don't want to mention them yet. Well, I'm not going to mention them at all, really. Uh, that's for you guys to check this film out when it is available in the UK. You guys in the US, it is already available to you. Please watch it and enjoy it like I did. Anyway, I'm going to shut my mouth. I'm going to let you guys go. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Bye. Oh, don't forget... Later on today, I will be putting another video on of the interview of me and Simon. So don't forget to check that out as well. It's going to be awesome. See you guys later. Bye. Up and hit that notifications button. That's because later on today, I'm also going to be reciting. notifications bell today i'm going to remove it uh, uh, all right please hit that subscribe button give this video a big thumbs up and hit that notifications bell oh i can't do it today like i said it's called butchers and it is written and directed by adrian langley and it stars <sighs>